How to blend your natural hair with a braided ponytail extension. Tightly braid your hair with the ponytail extension. Some shorter hair may stick out. Use no-fly zone hair pomade to seal the strands away. No-fly zone comes in two different holds of strong and medium. And just like that, you're ready to go. I take the hair how it comes out the pack, I split it in half, have the client hold one half in front of their face or clip it in front if you're doing it on yourself. And then I take the other half and secure it around their ponytail with the rubber band that comes on it. And then I'll split it into three equal sections and continue to braid. And then I'll add pieces of hair for their desired length or if I need any extra density in the hair. So I forgot to add that I also leave a piece out from the braiding hair so that I can wrap around the base of the ponytail. And this client when it curls, so I just added some mousse to the braid and added a flexi rod to the very end. And then I dipped the end of the braid into some boiling water. And then to get the curls in the final. I couldn't do any styles but my hair finally grew long enough where I could put in a little ponytail so I decided to do a braided one um I obviously have relaxed hair so this is way easier than if this is my natural hair texture let me put that out there I used some shine and jam in the yellow jar and some got to be spray and gel and that pretty much slicked down everything I needed it to um, my edges or anything literally won't move if I put on got to be. I was able to get a really slick pony and I was very proud of myself because I do not touch my natural hair. Like I'll do the wigs all day long, but when it comes to my natural hair, I just be like, no ma'am, <laughs> I'll, I'll leave that to the professionals. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, I just put the got to be all throughout my hair, put it in a little ponytail, brushed it back. And then I proceeded to do my baby hairs. Um, I also used this type of hair, which, uh, was really worked well, actually. And I looked up some YouTube videos, how to make the little ponytail. It was, it was easy. Actually, it was easier than I thought. 
Um, the braid and everything turned out pretty good. It was hard for me at first because it was hard for me to grab my um, little ponytail to try to like braid that in, especially with these nails on. Like y'all got talent if you could braid with nails on. Like that's crazy. But yeah, um, I did the little curl at the end of the braid and it just turned out super cute. I'm not used to seeing my natural hair out really, but I loved it. I I don't think that's gonna happen, but we'll see. Dance. Okay, just finished blow drying. Yeah, I got inches. Get in sweat. But I'm about to straighten it and then we're gonna do the ponytail. Bitch, if you're not fucking with Kesha, what are you doing? Okay, I just finished straightening it and put in ponytail. Right now, I just take the Murray's beeswax and get a little bit and brush, and it makes it so smooth. I'm gonna do the rest of my head. So I never finished in time, but we're about to finish right now. Get a hair tie and wrap it around so that it'll stay on better. Split it into three sections, and then leave a little piece to wrap around the band. Okay, split your real hair into three sections, and then start braiding and add some gel or beeswax. And we listening to Tory Lanez, get with it or get left. Okay, wrap this around. Okay, I finished. There's the back, edges. Tell me I look good.